be true to yourselves. Identify your strengths, your weaknesses, and embrace both. Where you are strong, develop the skills that will allow your strength to excel. Work the muscle. Train it. Push it beyond what you thought possible. And then change up the routine and start again. Where you are weak, don't settle. There was a strength in knowing what you're not good at. Admitting it takes courage, but it also demonstrates what we call character. In this lifetime, you are going to know a lot of people, and they will have a lot of opinions about what you should do. And then they'll tell you when they think you should do it. They'll push you to go straight or go right when your instinct is to go left. They'll tell you you shouldn't associate with her or him when you're thinking, but this is love. They'll tell you how to succeed because it's what they went through, what they think. Uh, as president, uh, the first thing I want to declare is that exams are over. And you can sit down. Uh, the last time there was a crowd standing up like that, they were chasing them. So we're, we're off to a good start tonight. But uh, first, let me congratulate all of you for taking the initiative to be part of this program. Those of you being inducted tonight, this is a wonderful opportunity for you. You've gotten an inkling of what leadership is about. And uh, I just want to put a little bit of a uh, closure on something that Professor Williams was getting to, in, in essence. And that leadership, your leadership, carries with it a responsibility. That's what it's really all about. It's about a responsibility. The responsibility to plan for the future. Whether you're planning your life, your family life, or the society around you, you carry that. You don't get there easily. You take this one step at a time. You have to learn a lot of things. But at the end of the day, Leadership bears a heavy burden, and that burden is to plan for the future. Most of my responsibility here at the college is, besides the day-to-day -day operation, is to plan for the future, to leave something better than you find it. And we have made a lot of progress here in that regard, and we're going to keep doing that. And we have a great crew here at the college and I'm proud to be associated with the institution, and I want to wish you all the best in your continued work here at the college. Uh, what you're doing here is the foundation for your future, and just remember this, you have to plan for the future, whether you're planning for next semester, or next year, or where you want to go next, that is the first hallmark of leadership. And you build on that leadership. And we're all here to help you do that. So again, I just want to congratulate everybody, and to the parents and uh, the other family members, loved ones that are here this evening, congratulations as well. I see they have uh, a nice cake over there, and uh, we have some certificates over here, so you're going to have a, a nice time this evening. And again, congratulations to all of you, and I'm sure you all did well on your exams. Keep up the good work. Thank you.
member as of today. Um, I've invited my mom here tonight. Hi, mom. And I've invited her because she she's my inspiration. She is the reason why I'm here today. And I can't thank her enough for everything that she has done for me for from now until whenever. And I and I thank you for that.